Well, welcome everyone who's already here. Um, uh, my name is Stacy. I'm the owner of Hamden, and I'm joined here by Hope, um, who is our account exec with CD Network, which is the multi-line showroom that represents Forte Forte. Um, and they represent many of the brands that are at Hamden and um, Hope and I have known each other for a long time. She's helped me with other collections and um, over the years. So she is a breath of fresh air and also very knowledgeable about this brand and very passionate about Forte Forte because she works on this brand um, solely. So, so nice to have you, Hope. Thank you. Thanks for having me. It's fun. And then in our other corner, we have Sophia, who's my assistant buyer. And we have two models today. Oh, and then yeah, we've got our Hamden team too watching downstairs on the on the sales floor so we can see people checking out. <laughs> I love it. Um, and we have two models today. And what we're looking at is fall 21. So you and what that means is we have deliveries from you maybe you're better to speak to this with the actual deliveries of each hope is. Yes. So this um, delivery here for fall is going to be between, um, it will start in July and then go through to October. So everything is made and shipped in Italy. So of course they'll take time um, producing from their factories. And then what you're ordering today will then not hit the floor until July through October. And you guys are the lucky ones that get to actually see it all before many of the buyers and shoppers will actually see it. Yeah. So literally it's like what you choose today is going to, the order is going to go to Italy and then they're going to go make it for you, which is crazy. And one of the reasons I love Forte Forte so much is because they, um, like most Italian companies, they own their factories. And so they're able to produce like one blouse in five different colors or this jacket in two different colorways. And that is not true for most of my um, U.S. brands or even brands out of Copenhagen, or even French brands. It's very unique to the Italian market that they're so in touch with their factories or own their own factories that they're able to offer so many different color variations. So um, I, that really was what attracted us to want to do this trunk show because it's hard for me to narrow down, <laughs> for, hard for me to choose which color I like the best or which color you guys might like the best. And so this is the opportunity to say, well, I bought it in this color, but you, if you like the blue, you can get the blue today, which is really, really awesome. So, um, we will get started with our first two models and I love when people interact and talk. So actually Catherine, um, maybe you want to unmute everybody, or maybe if you guys know how to unmute yourself at times, feel free to talk. You can also chat if you don't want to talk. I've got the whole chat up over here so I can answer your questions. And then of course our stylists are available and they're going to jump in and try some stuff on. I love it when it's interactive and fun and we're all just talking and playing with clothes because that's, we don't need to take life so seriously, especially right now because I'm stuck at home with COVID. So there you go. <laughs> um, I know it's terrible, but I'm surviving. Yeah. And just working from home. Um, and I feel fine. I just like have a head cold. So I feel just fine. Um, I may kill my husband, but I feel just fine. <laughs> yeah. um, all okay. right. First two models. Let's do it. Yes, get on file. Okay. Oh my gosh, I love this look. Okay, so one of the biggest trends going into next fall is plaid. There's a lot of plaid and Carrie here is wearing, if she wants to, um, the full Forte look, if you want to come forward, these are looks that I, myself and Sophia put together. So this is like the pink color variation and then Carrie, we're going to have you walk all the way, like uncomfortably close to the screen. There we go. And so this is the pink variation. And what is this fabrication? So everybody can know. So this is going to be a blend of wool and linen. Um, and in the pink, you, it's, it's sometimes a little difficult to see the, through the computer screen, but it's really nice. It has a very soft lavender kind of pinky color to it, a little bit of blue. Um, so you really get that multicolor effect, but it, it, um, it's just very feminine and then a little bit more of like the relaxed fit. Yeah, if you can see from this jacket, you wanna pull it open, Carrie. One thing I love about their blazers is it almost feels like a cardigan. 
when you put it on, it's very slouchy. It's very relaxed. It does not have these crazy shoulder pads. It almost feels like something, if you have a t-shirt, you just throw that over and wear jeans. It doesn't have to be so complicated. This is like the full look. And um, obviously this with the blue stripe, I think looks really great, even back to jeans. So if you do want to wear, like kind of make it your own, you could do like a rock and roll t-shirt and throw that on with jeans and um, be good to go and be very on trend, which is something fun. I get asked a lot, like what's an investment piece or something you should um, add to your closet, a piece of plaid going into fall would be great. Um, and she actually is wearing Forte Forte boots that we have in stock right now, which actually are their core and they're like a buttery soft leather, creamy white. They're very gold. They're showing up a little more white on screen to me than they actually are. Yeah. So. Thanks. Like you said, they're like a true buttery cream color. So they yeah. look like this. And, yeah. and actually, Celeste, do you want to walk in so we can show the two different color variations? <laughs> um, hello. Okay, so Celeste is wearing the blue color variation. And seeing them side by side, you can tell. If you guys both want to walk forward, we can see the blue and the pink. See, there's a little more teal on the right and there's more pink on the left. So you can do the shorts in the, yeah. You can do the shorts in the blue and the jacket in the blue, or you could do the pants in the pink and the jacket in the pink. Um, it's like, what is the undertones that you like to have? Yeah. Do you gravitate to more pinks? Or do you gravitate to more greens and blues, you know? And then, um, it, do y'all want to come even a hair closer? I know that's crazy, but there we go. Yeah. Is that better? So these are for fall 21, okay. this collection. And when I say fall, really what we're talking about is like August. It ships in August. Um, so you're getting to pick pieces before they've ever even been made. Um, and we will have all kinds of new stuff. We have brand new Forte Forte on the floor that is already shot and on a model and on our website. So definitely check out that collection. And then now you're getting a whole sneak peek into the forward pieces. So those are the um, two different colors. And then we've styled the pants back to the suede jacket. And Carrie, you can go get changed. Yeah. <clears throat> And again, she's wearing the Forte Forte boots and then a navy blue silk blouse and then same jacket cut just in a very thin, um, same cardigan kind of style suede jacket. Um, there's lots of texture of suedes and leathers for fall and this is so nice and there's lots of cream. And this is so nice because this one has like kind of a blush tone to it so it's not so washed out and it's very soft are the pants rolled up at the bottom I couldn't tell yeah I think they cuffed them but they won't be you can you can wear them down um uncuffed if you want as well I have I have those boots so I'm looking <coughs> to see yeah. I love the boots I love the boots what's the rise um it's a very good are they, question are they high rise because i'm <laughs> higher you know what's really nice that they've incorporated in these collections sort of with that casual trend that you're you're seeing for those of us that are working from home or in between they've introduced a really nice elastic waistband in the back so it does have that stretch but these ones specifically have a little bit more of the tailored look because hopefully by the time we're getting them we're all moving and grooving again um so you can wear them higher or you can pull them down slightly so the elastic back will help that but they're pretty high-waisted Yes, that's okay. a great style that Miss High Waist did. All right, bummer. <laughs> <laughs> and then the top that she's wearing underneath is a good example of what Stacy was saying of all the different colors that Forte produces. So this is a carryover fabrication. We offer it on the collection. Every single delivery, this style specifically, is our staple top. And it's, you know, we're seeing it here in a navy, but this specific one will come in six different colors and again it can be unique you know it's not like um you know you could have it you could order in the cream you could order in the blue while Stacy might have it for another color so it's a really cool way to play around with color for you personally will you untuck it Celeste so they can see um and maybe come forward so we can see the detail in it it's hard because it's like they 
with um this you have a wide screen this way and it's like we need vertical right so we can but can't change the computer hey um are those the real thin silk and cotton shirts that you're famous for okay love those and if you look on your lookbook that I think each of you got or is on our website as well, when you go to register, um, it shows you this blouse, the price, and then all the different colors you can get it in, which is really cool. Okay, you guys want to move on to the next look? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> this is Catherine, our e-commerce director. I think she's getting some height on it for us, which would be helpful. <laughs> Are there any um, standard pieces you guys love so much from Forte Forte? I personally love their pants. Like I have, a, I have a pair on right now. They're big, wide leg, and they have a big, wide el elastic band, and they're literally my favorite pants of all time. And I don't say that about many pants, really. <clears throat> um, this is awesome. So this is the suede pant, actually speaking of, that is matching back to that suede jacket. And so this is such a cool look, the suede um, outfit, a little aggressive if you don't want to wear all suede <laughs> or if you're not super on trend. But what's great about this, again, in the lookbook, it shows you all the different colors. So this suede outfit, we bought it in the like blush pink, but it actually comes in which colors? Black. Um, yeah, in a narrow and then like a little bit of a darker kind of camel color. Oh, yeah. Here you go. Here's yeah. another, the other camel color. And super, super soft and fluid. And the pants have this funky um, tie detail at the bottom that you can kind of, actually, I don't know if those, no, those don't have a tie. It's a little slit detail at the bottom. So you can kind of play with it, tuck it in, fold it up, but it's just an added um, touch to the, as it tapers down. And a lot, they've shown that kind of pant leg a lot because it kind of balloons out a little bit. It looks great with a flat or it does look really, it's intended also like that little slit can go tucked into your boots or even left out because it does have the slit. So um, it's kind of a cool new way to wear your pants. And then we have that same pink plaid blazer with, um, yeah, we can put that on. But the same pink plaid blazer that she had on with the shorts we just put back on with these suede pants to show it as a tonal look instead of matchy matchy. And then she'll put the whole suede outfit on. So again, if you want the blouse in black, the pants in black and the jacket in black done, you actually can do that and make that happen today, which is wild, you know? Or if you yeah. want it in that caramel color, will you hold that up again, Sylvia? You're more in, or even if you're like, you know what? I just want that camel suede jacket. Totally. So pretty. Mm -hmm. Very chic. I feel like a lot of their pieces too, which are so good, um, are um, pieces that will last your lifetime. There's not anything about this that is totally trend driven, especially that blazer. Yeah, you wanna go ahead and throw that coat on. Um, you can throw it over the um, suede, there we go. Hi, Mina. Mina is one of my best friends in fashion, and she is Hope's boss. <laughs> I have COVID. Good times. I know. I'm getting a lot of work done, though, at home. It's probably the longest you've been home ever. Ever. Get of days. Ever, 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 ever. ever. Yeah. And I was supposed to go on a vacation to the Bahamas today. Oh, no. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Very, very painful. Um, but here, I am with you guys. Way better talking about fashion. Mm -hmm. um, I, I love this jacket. So this is another example. This jacket actually, or coat, comes in this blush pink color, which this is how we are going to style it in the store. But it also comes in a blue plaid color um, that's really pretty. And um, I think it's hanging on that rack. Yeah, perfect. So we are buying the blue plaid in the fringe coat. See, so can, this gives y'all a peek into buying as well. It's totally overwhelming, right? You're like, oh my God, there's so many choices. Um, so I did this coat in the pink and then the blue um, plaid we have here in the fringe. 
um, which is super fun, but you could have it vice versa. If you like, if you're like, you know what, that French coat really is cool. Um, then you could do that instead. I love the soft tones of this because there's so much camel and cream coming in for, um, fall and spring as well. So this is a coat that will go over probably everything in your closet and it's not so in your face. <laughs> okay. Are y'all liking it? Y'all like yes. it? I know it's beautiful. I love it. How thick is this? Is the suede material? Is that a thicker suede or? It's like um, so thin. It's crazy. And, and it's so lined. It's thicker on the, in the darker color. I feel like. Yeah. I know what you mean. It has a For little. For some reason. Uh, Will you open the jacket up maybe, um, Sophia? Okay. And even hold the, hold it up against like the screen. I know, no thickness wise. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh -huh. really fluid. It has a really nice, soft, relaxed hand to it. It looks like it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's very thin and pretty. Speaking of French jackets, mm -hmm. I love this one in the all cream. It's heaven. It's so cool. We put it back to this beautiful little floral sweater. There's not a lot of times that I like a sweater that has graphic on it, but I love this sweater. I think it's so pretty and elegant and it has some really fun details. Um, we kind of half tucked it into the, speaking of pants I love, like this pant, I love. Um, it still has, it has the fluidity in the leg. Um, and that's why I like these pants from Forte that I'm wearing right now, because it feels, you know how you walk and you get that little bit of movement, like. Annie Hall, 1970s, like really cool. That is this pant. And this is the pant you're gonna want going into fall with like a big chunky cream sweater. Is that the denim, is that the denim sort of light denim pant? So it's actually, I was gonna say it, it it's a wool linen blend. It's, I mean, you can't really see virtually is it has a bit of a texture to it. So it's almost got like the subtle groove, like um, diagonal feel to it. Um, it's, it's slightly on um, a little bit more weighted. So what is good about it, cause it's sampled here in the cream, it's a cream pant that you can wear and you feel comfortable. It's not going to be too sheer. Um, so it's perfect for fall though, because it does with that, that woolen and blend, it has a bit more weight to it, um, with some good texture. Yeah. <clears throat> and it's a great winter weight. And then does that in the back have the, um, elastic? that one does not okay so that's a little bit more of their true button trouser trouser but the the wide leg really has that sort of effortless feel to it yeah. and then um see the pink sweater has that red trim at the bottom which is very unexpected i think it looks really cute and then the um the jacket is like a nubby boucle cozy throw on cardigan again feel to it there's such an ease when I first met Giada um, Forte, she always wanted to put me in her collection and would like put a sweater on me and then a jacket and then a scarf. And like, that's how she herself just like lives in texture and, and layers up. And so I feel like there's an ease to everything about the collection that doesn't feel so restricted because that's not her life and her lifestyle. So, um, very yeah. cool and actually this sweater too was inspired by a sweater that she used to own many years back with that graphic on it so she wanted to incorporate it into this collection but really soft a little bit of a loftier knit and then also another example of this would come in black as well with a black background do the pants come in black too um uh, those ones i do not believe come in black no mm -hmm. and we're gonna put the plaid um like coat trench on her over this just to show that it doesn't have to be with a solid it looks really cute over something um super simple um do we have kate or jill in there too i unmuted they're coming over <laughs> oh, okay. this is so cute okay so in the plaid family i could not resist Oh, hi, Jill. Yay. And we have some of our stylists here today, too, because I was like, I, I don't want to be the only one literally on screen. I want other people like trying things on and and stuff. So um, 
Jill has like one of the little nubby um, cardigan soft cozies and all the pieces are samples. They're not like our, you know, they're not even fit to like a normal exact size, but, um, and so I want them to try some of the pieces on so you can see them on different bodies, different heights and everything. Um, and one of the jackets Jill's wearing is, Jill, can you come all the way forward? It's got like this almost like chenille coziness to it. Love it, love the pockets. I know. So and what's great is the little toggle. I love the toggle. It feel that too feels like very vintage feeling. <laughs> Like great, great. wide leg pant and it's got these little slits in the back. So if it was, yeah. Um, and then Kate has on this awesome fringe. Speaking of the nubby um, long coat with the fringe at the bottom, this is the other colorway that you can do the same long coat in as well. <clears throat> Correct, Hope? Yes, exactly. So it'll come as a sample there, cream, and then you can also get it in a red. Oh, wow. Yeah. Red. <laughs> um, so this is the plaid trench, which I personally love. And I think it is such an amazing statement piece. I'd never does a trench have to be belted or fully clothed. I think it looks awesome with something printed underneath. And I'm not always good about mixing prints, but um, I love the floral. And we have some other like micro floral in um, dresses and jackets. And um, I think this is such a fun way to wear this coat. And if you don't, you're like, you know what? I'm not a blazer person, but I want some plaid. I think it would be something fun. This is the way to do it. Yeah. And this has all the multicolor plaid too. So you don't have to commit to the one. It kind of brings in all different colorways. Super chic. Very forte forte to do a statement coat sort of their, you know, every every delivery, they offer that one sort of funky, crazy statement coat. And this is their, their trench coat of the season. And this is one of their classic coats, which is awesome. It is, you're probably going to see 5 million camel coats for fall 21. And this, this is such a cool, um, and what's the blend on this one? This one is also going to be a wool blend. Um, it is lined on the inside in the silk, which is nice. Um, and then it has that tie belt detail. Um, and this one can come in a lot of colorways too. So you have that really nice classic bamboo color, which has actually been very popular for me. But then there's other colors you can do like hot pink, cream, black and a lavender color. So you can be bold and kind of bring in a, a fun statement colorway or keep it very just timeless and neutral on the bamboo. You know how like you get something stuck in your mind and you're like, I just cannot find that blush pink coat that I want. Like today you can, you know, <laughs> you're like for five years, I've been looking for a red coat. I love, you know, like, here you go. Now's your opportunity. Okay, so Carrie has on our next look, which is again, speaking in the all camel and creams, this button front skirt, it's definitely high-waisted. And then we've got the um, like padded coat. I love that the skirt has pockets mm -hmm. and this is reversible, isn't it? This jacket? Oh, it actually, will not be. <laughs> oh, it won't be a reversible yeah, for yeah. production. No, okay. Focus on just the, the quilted outside, but again, yeah. one of their really fun outerwear pieces. The skirt um, is that same fabric in the pant that we saw earlier. So it has a little bit, um, oh, sorry, that one's in, a, in a, a softer fabric, but it gets a little bit weighted like the pant we saw earlier. So again, it doesn't become too sheer. The buttons, I think, make it super cool and updated. Mm -hmm. And then the sweater she's wearing is a, um, it's a blend, really soft, kind of has nice um, weight to it. <laughs> There's a lot of shearling for fall. And this is fun because this is, Faux and um, a way to almost do shearling without really wearing shearling or buying it. And this is um, way less heavy as well. So pretty. Love it. Oh, and then one option also, instead of doing the skirt, if you're not a skirt person, is to do this pant. And this has an elasticated waist entirely, right? Yeah. This is like their awesome pull on total, you know, response to this casual trend, but the fabrication is really sophisticated 
and again, has a little bit of weight to it. So it transitions nicely into the fall months. And if you're looking for that lower rise, then this is a good option for you for sure. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Super cute. But all the cream, all the cream all day. Yep. Cute. Thank you. What's next? Uh, and yeah. now if you don't like cream, we have hot pink for you. <laughs> Amazing. Um, this fringe dress is incredible. I think this, I love the kind of Western trend because it goes straight in a V in the front and a V in the back. And again, I love this belt because it only has the two little notches, which you can take off and tie this belt wherever you want at your smallest part of your body. And then if you don't even want to wear the belt, you don't have to, or you could throw on one of her great leather belts um, and just tie that in a knot as well. But I think this dress is so fun and it comes in what other colors if you don't want to do hot pink. Ones are going to be pink. It comes in a burgundy. It came in a black, a cream. I think I'm missing any colors. No, I believe those are the four colors. Yes. It's so cute. Can we get a little closer on the top part so we can see the fringe? Here we go. Awesome. And then it's just a button front. Yes, Correct. button front and then a nice wool viscose georgette. So it has a really cool kind of almost dry hand to it. So it doesn't feel super heavy. Um, and then the fringe is just something that she she played around with this this collection. So I think it kind of adds a little bit of dimension. It looks <laughs> <it's> awesome. <laughs> it's so fun. Maybe we could put that blue plaid jacket over her. I have my assistant Vanna White in the background. Um, mm -hmm. I had so much fun making looks with this collection. I was like, there's so many options. I couldn't even narrow down like what I wanted to show. Yeah, but, she did a really good job, especially with this delivery and making looks. And, and they're always great for that is everything kind of somehow matches back together, even if it's like a print with a plaid with different colors. So it's really fun with everything that Stacey's showing here. You really can kind of mix and match it all. So. Thank you. So fun. Who wouldn't want to wear that with jeans and a t-shirt too? So easy. I'm getting my COVID voice. <laughs> What else do you guys have for us? Any, any other looks or pieces? Yay. So Jill had on the brown um, coat. This is the purple version. And it looks, I wanted to style it over this dress because it does have so many hints of different colors in it. And this really pulls out the little bit of purple that's in there. And Giada does such a good job with these floral prints that they're not too sweet. They feel feminine, but not sweet, which I very much appreciate. Yeah, and like Stacey was saying, lots of different colorways in there until you're gonna have that full button down again, which you can wear belted, unbelted. And on this specific shape, she did a really nice um, collar detail. So if you're close, wearing it closed, um, it kind of wraps around or you can wear it open. I know sometimes people like to, to kind of have an open neckline but it's in our satin silk, so it's a nice weight. And this is like, like Stacey was saying, the same coat we saw earlier, but this is an example of one of them, the colorways that it's offered in. So pretty. Can we take the jacket off and see the sleeve on the dress real quick? Just a really clean classic shirt dress. And can we untie it just to see the, um, if we wanted to leave it loose? Easy, flowy or tie it in a different way. Mm -hmm. Love it. Perfect. That looks so pretty. How you doing? Okay. Love this. So she was just tying it in the back, which makes it nice and slim. And then you don't feel like you have to have a boob shelf as I call it, because I have big boobs and like have, you know, have all, a definition between such a definition between your waist um because i have no waist and that's really the issue <clears throat> thank you carrie um so she carried the same print into two pieces 
And we're going to see that next because they, I love that you don't have to be a dress person. You can do the matching sets or you can break them apart, but you can get touches of those florals and your only choice doesn't have to be that one dress or that one piece. So this is the blouse with the um, pants and the, tell me the fabric of the pants. Yeah, so fabric of both of those pieces are actually really cool. So the pant is a micro cord, but it's very lightweight. So it doesn't feel bulky, it's not heavy. I remember correctly, I want to say the pants have an, a, a little bit of an elastic back. Yes, they do. So that's a nice way again, to kind of play around with whether it's high or low. And then the top she's wearing is actually in almost, it's a very fine wool. It's almost like a wool chalet. So it has a lot of fluidity to it. Um, it does have the tie up detail and then it's underneath the jacket, but it has these really pretty um, kind of feminine uh, shoulder details. And really fun as a full look. I'm a, I'm a very tonal dresser, so I love making full looks, but then also to completely separately. So you could wear the top with just a pair of jeans and then the, the bottom with a really fun, colorful knit. Or that cream knit that you're gonna own because you're gonna have a lot of them. <laughs> like, actually, I'm very excited because I was looking the other day and I really wanted to wear like a cream or ivory and I don't have any. So um, I'm excited to get some, but if you don't wanna wear jeans all day, every day, this is a way to do a print without it being um, too wild and crazy or geometric, it keeps it feminine. And you're right, it's very rare that um, you have a cool pant that you can wear with a bright color or fuchsia and you have some amazing cardigans. Actually, do you have um, that fuchsia cardigan over there? My Vanna White? <laughs> Ta-da! Yay, great. <laughs> Did she throw that on? And that's something, if you like the fit of that, that um, you can get in multiple colors as well, correct? Yes. So if you're watching this live or later um, and don't have the lookbook, all you gotta do is message us even on Instagram or message us on live chat on our website. Um, but you should be able to download it if you go to, um, where, where on the website, Catherine, if you go to go to the events page and it'll be listed there, just click on the events page, click on the virtual trunk shows and um, it'll be linked there. And this is great. Forte is really known for their punchy colors, especially in the knit family. So this is a really fun way. It's hot, hot pink. It has a little bit of a ribbing detail to it. This specific sample, they they styled it slightly on the oversized kind of slouchier feel. So this is a larger sample than we normally get. You can wear it a little bit more fitted, more shrunken, but it's been really popular. Yeah. And then colors, like Stacey was saying, you can get a cobalt blue. We have it in cream. There's sort of like a really nice neutral army color. And then what they call meal, which is almost like this honey yellow colorway. Actually, Sophia, can you hold up that army green color? I think we have in the blue color maybe of the sweater we're gonna show in a minute. <clears throat> I think she might have it in the back for her try on, yeah. So if you're looking for a good, like that would be beautiful with that outfit as well. If you're way more into tonal dressing and do that army cardigan. See, this is my problem. I do these trunk shows and then I'm like, well, we need that. We need that sweater for the store. It's so cute. Why didn't I buy that? So adorable, okay. Next up, I love doing these things. I hope you guys are having fun. Okay, talk about fringe. This this is a maze, heaven on earth. Um, and this is actually a top and a skirt. Mm -hmm. It is not a dress, who knew? So, um, and it's got the big blue sash in the back, super fun. There is certainly a Western theme. Um, so for fall, we've already said lots of cream, Western and um, plaid. So three huge trends that will be consistent in all the collections, I promise. So and you're seeing it here first per usual. Um, so she's got the floral outfit on and then this is the dress version. So it's V-neck, it's got a little bit of navy trim. Will you come forward, Sophia? It's got a little bit of a slit, really classic, very feminine, 
Um, I love that she's doing V necklines for us and not everything is up to, up to the collarbone. Um, the dress is really great. And then this separates are amazing because of course, if you don't want the head to toe look, you can just put a cream sweater or you can put a Navy sweater or a cobalt blue sweater um, with this skirt and have it as an item. And then you can do the red shirt, even back to those elastic waist cream pants or the big fluid, um, the button front. Yeah. With those pants or the button front ones that she had on. So last out on earlier that, um, I said are really fluid. Those are great. Um, there's a lot of different ways to style this blouse. And then we could even put on, go crazy with fringe and put on that big cream coat um, with the fringe at the bottom because we keep showing that. But like, I love it. It's just so versatile. It really goes with everything. Yeah, that's so cool. And then if you didn't want the long one, you can do the short fringe, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, you could do the short fringe jacket with... Um, in the cream, right? Mm -hmm. Exactly. So if you're like, you know what, that's going to swallow me. I'm five, three. Um, okay. So maybe this is your and put that on. I love that. And if you're like, you know what, I know, but I just don't love that color. Don't forget. You can change it. If you want it in cream, red. What yep. else were your options here? Yeah. So in that color. Like yellowy green and then cream. Yeah. Exactly. We don't even need you, Hope. I'm already <laughs> memorized it. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Um, awesome. Again, like total cardigan style, easy, and it's fun, fun way to do the fringe without being so serious. And without, I mean, when do you ever see it in like wool boucle rather than leather, you know? Okay, what we got next, Sophia? One second. Okay. <laughs> Does one of our stylists want to try something on? Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah. oh, full fringe ready. You guys, this is a jumpsuit. Are your minds blown like mine were? I was like, what? So it's so fun. Um, you know what's even better too is during my market appointment, I didn't even get to see these clothes on. Yeah. Yeah. So I had to buy it with her just holding it up to the screen like this. But we would not do you guys that way. No. Or better. So I actually wore that jumpsuit during my, during market for appointments. <laughs> yeah, it's so cute. It's so much fun. Um, it has just is is there any elastic at the waist or is it just tie? High waist deep, yeah. Just a tie. Mm -hmm. Very it easy. It has a little bit of weight to it. Again, it's that kind of very fluid wool, shally like fabric. And then the funky fringe. Super cool statement piece definitely a statement piece. We did not buy this for the store, but I think it's really, really cool and very fun. So you should get it now if you like it. So it, their sizing is one, two, three, four, five. Um, so one is an extra small, two is a small, three is medium, four is a large, five is an extra large. So we can, and we can do a zero, um, be the smaller and then, yeah. It's um, so that, for example, is a sample size one. It's what I wear and I'll be between a two and a four sometimes, so. Okay. And then Sophia is showing us that awesome print in a blouse, which has that little same kind of Western detail. Um, and so we showed earlier the blouse in with the tie neck and puff sleeve. This is another version, just the simple button down with the Western detail. And then we also have it in, it also comes in the alternative, which is the navy blue print. So your two alternatives for this is the cream or the navy. Um, we'll see the, and can you do the jumpsuit in navy? That one you can do in navy, yes. Oh, well. Yes. Which we have, I think, the pants that you're going to be showing we soon. The navy. Yeah. Love it. Yes. Yeah. So um, we'll show another colorway in a matching outfit in a second. But I love the fringe. I think it's really fun. That's when you're like walking down the street and you're like, I'm out of COVID. I got a fringe jumpsuit on. Let's do it. Okay. More fringe. Yeah, more fringe. I think the sweater is gorgeous. I think it is so beautiful. 
and this, I kind of like that the fringe doesn't move oddly. <laughs> There's something like less in your face about it. Um, but it's a turtleneck sweater. And then all we did was layer that over top of the actually same red button down that she had on with the wrap skirt. And we put it on with the navy silk pants, correct? So those ones are the, it's again, that like wool chalet. It does have a silk detail up top, which is in that wet red print. Um, it does have a button closure and a tie, but a really relaxed fit, very comfortable, easy to, to wear, easy to pair back many, many different colors with. Um, the, the knit that we're wearing in the fringe, again, sort of hard to see it online, but it has a really nice multi yarn detail. So it adds a bit of dimension to it. Um, and it has a blend of a little bit, like it has like a silkier feel. And um, this is how Giada styled it in the lookbook. So we wanted to show it to you this way. And then it, the red trim is actually part of the pants. And so we, that's why we put it back um, to the red shirt. If you want to take the sweater off for us, Gary. So we have those pants and then um, Sophia, if you want to show the navy matching blouse, um, so you can do the matching navy blouse instead of doing the red version. Yep. And is the red, yeah, the red is the same as the cream that we showed you. So we've got that same blouse in cream and red and navy. And then you can do make even this look like a jumpsuit. Yes. Um, so many different options. And that top is again, it's in our cotton silk fabrication. So carryover fabric, same as what we showed in that solid in the beginning. So it's really light, very breathable, layered, worn it by itself. It's been, it's a strong fabric for us. And there's a solid version again that Sophia is holding and Sophia is wearing. <laughs> yes, love. I do love this blouse because it has a big swing A-line and a lot of her other blouses are very tailored. Um, so it's just a different fit, a different look, a different body shape. I would love the one Sophia is wearing. And then if you're, you know, really slim on top and like, then this is the red one's a great fit for you. Awesome. Love. I love these prints. I really like the prints she did this season. One, I'm a big Navy person and a big cream person, but and then if you're not a print person, we wanted to show you guys some solids and remind you, it's not just print driven, I promise. So there's this easy, again, um, green dress, this a little bit of a micro check. Exactly. Yep. And it has a little bit of a, a wool linen hand to it. So it's slightly more weighted, but really good for that fall delivery. You can transition it straight into the later months with some booties and some tights. Um, again, with the tie, you can wear it loose, you can wear it closed, it has the full button down. And then this amazing hot pink coat is the same family as the one that we saw in the lavender and bamboo. This one's going to be slightly more of a tailored look. So if you want to do like that bold color and a cleaner look, you can definitely go here. I'm obsessed with this hot pink. I think it's amazing. Also, you guys, you know, in the South, you can wear color. So <laughs> it's good. Um, I do love the army green and the pink together. Um, because I feel like a lot of people think with a pink jacket, like what, what are my options of wearing this with? And there's more than you even realize. So, um, I do love it styled like this and a little more tonal, if you will. Very cute, but it is nice to know that you can get this jacket in like the camel color. You can get it in the purple color, um, hot pink and so many different options. Yay. So if this is more your vibe rather than the tie waist, then you have the option now. And that's why we do these awesome events is to allow you the opportunity to make it your own. And what else do we have next? I think we have a couple more. Mm -hmm. Ugh, speaking of plaid, I love this little plaid bomber. It's so fun. And then this is the bright blue knit that we were talking about. You can do the cardigan in all these colors. This is one of the colors you can do the cardigan in is that bright blue. And then this pant is kind of a micro check as well. Same as the green dress she just had on. And can you do these pants in the green? 
Yes, you can. Green, it also comes in a black and white check here in the blue and white check, came in like a coral and green check. Um, same pull on style as we saw on the solid earlier on. Um, so super comfortable. You can wear it high, you can wear it low. And what do you think your phone watch is, it's kind of pulled up, Carrie. Like it's rolled your pants. There you go. There you go. Looks like it's weird. Uh oh, Leslie Shannon. Oh my God, what I do? <laughs> dead. I'm like, dead. what world did we just enter? <laughs> I love it. Uh, um, so those pants are great. They're fully elastic. We bought them in the blue and, um, and then we have the matching top that Sophia is holding. That's in that same blue micro check, but because I've shown you so many different, um, you know, matching outfits, I was like, I will try and break it up a little, um, and show you that it doesn't always have to be together, but I do love this pant easy pull on and cute with the, um, bomber jacket. What size is the bomber jacket? That's size two. So slightly, again, normally we sample in a size one, but they wanted this kind of oversized cool look. Um, so of course, you know, she, the, the model would probably wear a size one, go down a size, but it's nice just to know that you can wear it kind of full and relax. And it does have that elastic back, really comfortable on and mine in the silk. Yeah, so cute. Oh, Kenzie. Yay, one of our other stylists is here and she's trying on the blouse that we just showed, which is great. What I love is that Sophia has them tucked into like a high-waisted short that's Forte Forte that we have in right now. And then um, Kenzie has it out and you would never think that that's the same blouse, you know? Because when you see it on a hanger, you think, oh, it's big and flowy, but it doesn't always have to be. You absolutely can tuck it in and make it easy. I love those shorts. <clears throat> Sophia stuff in right now. <laughs> There's so much good new spring. It's incredible. We have literally so much in right now. It's crazy. Oh, love this. Going into our still Western vibe. I feel like she like, you know, went and shot a bear and then came home and she's like, but I'm chic, you know? <laughs> I love it. And vests. Okay. Wait, vests are another trend. Okay. That's our fourth trend plaid, all cream, um, vests and, um, and shearling. <laughs> yeah. The one that I said earlier, Western, Western. Oh, now we have five. There we go. Shearling. Yeah, and these are the same family. So you have the jacket that was seen on earlier and then you have the vest. It's our echo faux fur, but it feels really nice and cool. It has a little bit of like a striping texture to it. The vest has been really great. It's very different. Like Stacey was saying, it's a little bit more of a trend right now. There's so many other coats too. So a lot of people have been kind of pulling in this unique look in the vest. And then the dress is like, a, it's a really good, um, fluid fabric. It has a little bit of a texture where the stitching is. And again, same thing. You have that sash belt that you can wear clothes to give yourself a figure or just totally wear wide and open and, and relaxed. The sun is not working with us. And it's an easy, just blue and white stripe. Mm -hmm. And it's tied at the neckline. Yes, but you can wear it open. Yeah. Will you untie it for me? Oh yeah. That's our other version. So uh, the top is amazing because it has that big blue sawn sleeve and it does have that fuller A-line shape, which I personally love. Like that blouse will absolutely be in my closet. I love that thing. Um, and then the tie waist um, dress, will you untie the fringe? And then we could even maybe knot it on the side just to give her a different vibe, you know? And it really does make a difference on when you're in the dressing room and when you're taking the time to tie it in a bow or tie it on the side or untie the neckline or tie it in the bow, how you would normally wear it. It really makes a difference in whether you um, feel like the items for you. I feel like the dress just completely changed um, with us, like kind of leaving it more relaxed and easy like that. Super cute. And this would be great with the big plaid coat over it. It would be great um, with the purple coat over it or the hot pink. 
jacket with it. Ooh, the plaid blazer. I'm very into that because we showed that right at the beginning. <laughs> I love stripes and especially a thin little stripe like that in a plaid jacket. Can she put the plaid jacket on for us? Until Carrie is ready for her next look. I'm very into that. It's so cute. I love a dress and a blazer and not enough people do it because they think it's so serious, but with Forte, Forte's jackets, they're so soft and easy. Then that is a wonderful piece to grab. Very cute. Yay. Love this. Okay. We took the sweatshirt um, of the like sweat outfit because I know so many people are like, I have enough sweat outfits. I really want to move on. But if you want to take even a sweat outfit you already own and break it apart, it can be versatile. You don't need to like get rid of them. Maybe even take the sweatshirt you already own and put it back to a beautiful skirt like this. And then Sophia is holding the matching pant. Um, this fabric is so nice though, I do have to say, and a little dressier. So it is meant to wear out of the house and maybe even put that rib inside your boot and make it a cool and fresh new look. Um, but I wanted to show the sweatsuit broken apart so it wasn't so um, COVID related and it was a little more dressy and fun. Um, don't forget all the shoes are for sale. Um, actually the shoes they've been wearing are all on our website right now and are in stock because they stock a lot of their core boots. Fantastic job, Vanna. Thank you. <laughs> um, the burgundy and the cream are your two options. The burgundy, we don't have in stock right now. That'll be for fall. The, um, cream we have in stock right now. Um, and no one, um, needs to follow the rules anymore. You can wear a pair of boots in March and April and whatever the heck you want because it looks really cool with the flowy spring dress. So I love this. Carrie, will you push up your sleeves a little? I think it always takes the weight out of like, there we go. That helps. Cute. All right. Speaking of sweat outfits, thank you. Um, I went ahead and went full plaid on this guy because it's just so fun. And it's elastic waist pants, right? Yeah. I mean, it needs to be with this thing. And then you've got <laughs> Catherine, I love it. And and then the like um, hoodie. Um, what do we call that again? Yeah, it's like a little pullover hoodie. It has the hood, it has the tie, it has the, the front pocket. Yeah. Well, like, you know. Baja, Baja. That's what I'm thinking. Oh. A little Baja, you know? Yes. Um, and we did buy a few of those for fall as well. Um, but this is great. Again, broken apart. You can wear that navy, bright blue cobalt sweater. And you can wear it with these pants. You could wear this little Baja with some jeans. Such a fun, easy piece. Um, and I wanted to like go into casual and feel comfortable. Um, you know, we've seen dressy stuff and fringe and plaid pants and suiting and jackets and all different things. And this is nice and comfy. Um, so feels like what you want to throw on on a Tuesday and run out because this does not look like a sweat outfit. It just looks cool. Yeah. Um, and then I think we have one more look for her. That yes. I was like, okay. I don't know what theme it goes into. <laughs> yep. Yeah. It is, it is the animal print. And in case <laughs> you want to get wild and crazy, you can have purple animal print can have like a orangey animal print that you're about to see. And um, is there anything anybody, ooh, cute. I'm a big fan of shorts and boots, but I'm a big fan of shorts, period. And I know a lot of people hate them, but my legs are like the one and only thing I love. So, um, and I love an oversized sweater. This is a very me outfit. And then she's got the cute um, like purple socks um, that are part of the samples with the cream boots, so. She's, she's like, wow, she's yeah, ready to go. Loving it. Yeah. Ready to come out of COVID on fire. Yeah. Um, but I do love those shorts, like back to that even peachy colored top that, um, Kinsey was wearing. Um, 
Oh, that's so pretty. Yes. Back to those shorts because they're tonal. And these are kind of a wool fabrication. So they have a little more texture to them. So they are, when you feel them, you'll be like, okay, these are meant to be worn like in the fall. Lucy, I really see you in these. I think they'd be super cute on you. Um, and then I feel like in that blush pink tone, you can do a lot of different colorways mm -hmm. and things like that. So I wonder if there's anything else anybody wants to see on or didn't need to see again, or um, we have a whole rolling rack full of goodies. Um, all of us are here for you. Please text your stylist. Again, if you do not have one, um, you're, excuse me, <coughs> more than welcome to text the store number which is 843-724-6373. And anyone is happy to help you. You can message us on live chat and you can message us on Instagram. We're always available and we're here to help. And Catherine, thank you for putting that up on the screen. And this is really a cool opportunity and it's not easy to make the decision. So that is why we're here to help you. We do not want you to get something that you're like, why in the world did I buy that? We want you to be like, do you think I'll wear this? You know, um, but you know, if you like to wear all black, then this is a great opportunity to grab that suede jacket that we're buying in the blush color. Um, or if you need some funky suede black pants, now's the opportunity. Or if you love the blue plaid, then now's the opportunity to get it in the shape you want. So um, fashion is really um, coming to you in a whole new way. And I love that COVID has um, made that part of it and given us the opportunity to get you guys more involved on the front end and say, um, I get to kind of create my own selection. So um, yes, don't worry if you miss, there's total recording and um, we're going to send it to you. And um, oh, sure, we can the, show the suede blazer again. I'm a big fan. Maybe let's have her try on the camel and the pink. Mm -hmm. Is anyone here to try it on? Sophia's like, I guess it's me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, do you normally wear like a size two, right? Um, two, but in Giada, you normally wear like a one, right? Okay. Yes. Oh, he doesn't like to talk. <laughs> I have to unmute us. <laughs> no, no. Um. Yeah, I think this is like a small, right? Yeah, that's a size one. So that would be. It looks like it could be your size, Sophia, in the, it's yeah. a little bit more of a slim fit, but again, the, the fabric is very soft and malleable and, and kind of a space for, for movement. So it doesn't feel constricting. Yeah. I truly love this collection. Um, and more importantly, I love the people behind it, which makes it um, that much more um, exciting to sell and be part of. So hope you're awesome. Thank you for all of your support and making this happen because you guys, it was not easy. Oh, I love this outfit. Oh, surprise. <laughs> um, can you tell I like what I do? I really like love the clothes. I'm like, yes. I don't even like them for me. I'm like, somebody's going to be so cute in this outfit. And actually Lucy, I feel like this might be real cute on you. So, um, but the blush, um, button up that we showed at the very beginning with the, with the suede pants, this is the same blouse with the blush blazer and then the shorts and those boots. I mean, yes. Um, and Lisa, I feel like there's so many, I could totally see you in that cream long, um, like cardigan jacket with the fringe. I love that. Um, there's so many things. So thank you guys for joining and we love doing this. We love your feedback even more. If there's things we can do better, um, we are here to listen, believe it or not. And um, we want your feedback and we want to keep making this fun and exciting and keep bringing um, amazing designers to you. So thank you for joining us. Love you guys. Love you, Hope. Love you, Sophia. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.